In today's video, I'm going to be showcasing this discard deck that consists of pool or series one, two, and three cards. It has basically um, like two lines that I try and focus on. So I either try and make Apocalypse really big if I end up seeing uh, Dracula, or I try and just discard a bunch of stuff um, and hopefully Hella or Ghost Rider into Hella. Um, I've seen discard decks go. Um, a few different ways like some run like Moon Knight. I like the Black Cat honestly just because if I don't play it You know, it just discards itself so Hella can bring it back the last turn. So just getting uh, Six points for free is pretty cool um, You know just on top of the, all the other stuff you've discarded Also, if um, let's say you don't have uh, Hella and you don't know if you're gonna play her you can turn for Ghost Rider and have a chance to pull her so it'll turn for it's a you know uh, nine point play, which isn't too bad. Uh, Mobius gets super, super huge every time you. Um, he gets plus two for every card you've discarded that game. Uh, Blade is just to you know start the discards early. If you hit Swarm, you your chances of winning that game. I don't I don't know how much higher they get, but they got to get significantly higher. Um, Colleen Wing um, two drop for uh, four power on reveal. Discard the lowest cost card from your hand. So if you have Swarm in your hand with her, then it's just a guaranteed way of um, procking the swarm unless of course you have a mobius or blade in your hand lady sif is something else you could take out for like a moon knight or gambit maybe but i really like the games where um, i play her and i don't have hella but i have apocalypse just to have a bomb to play on turn six or again um a very large dracula and then uh, let's see, we also have the Hell Cow on reveal, discard two cards from your hand. So it can just get your count really high for Hella. Sometimes you have to risk discarding the Hella, but you know, that's okay. Cause if you hit Swarm or Apocalypse, then you're just making your other play stronger anyway. And then we have the Swordmaster, which this is the one that I could see the argument for um, the Moon Knight or Gambit or something like that, just because it is at random. So you could hit your Hella, right? But I think it's worth it just to have uh, six power for three because even there are games where things don't go the way you want to at all. Like you don't discard the swarm, you discard your Hella. Ghost Rider doesn't get back Hella, but all these cards are just so well statted that it just doesn't really matter sometimes anyway. So I'm just gonna hop on the ladder and see how it goes. ZDS. Don't know what that's a reference to. Maybe it's their initials. I do not know. On reveal effects do not happen at this location, so probably not going to play there very much. I could play Dracula there and Apocalypse on turn six. It's just Mobius in the middle. I want to keep the wing in case I draw the swarm, right? All right. This would discard um, Lady Sif. I'm gonna risk the Lady Sif and see if I can hit the Apocalypse. Very nice. Um, I think I need a Hell Cow. Even though I don't want to hit um, really Dracula or Hella, but I need to get some more discards off if Hella is going to be good anyway. And I need Apocalypse to grow a little bit more. So I think this is okay. And then also it's going to grow our Morbius. So I think this is completely reasonable. And our Hella can also um, spawn something here. How many cards have I discarded too? Hmm. I mean, I guaranteed win this location if I play this, so I think I'm just gonna take it. Okay. Now, if they play 
onslaught, then I still win this location and I still win this location. Yeah, I was going to say, I don't think they can win because I can either Hello or Apocalypse in the left and win. So I think that was a decent showcase of the deck's power. You know, not too bad. Sir pumps a lot. <laughs> All right. So Black Cat's going to discard herself, which is fine. I really hope I draw something that I don't mind. Something smaller than Swordmaster so I can uh, wing next turn. I don't know what they're thinking about on turn one. Okay. Now they know what we're playing. Draw a card. Okay, that could be actually helpful. Okay, well, this makes this a little bit easier. I'll play Mobius in the middle. Okay. Usually those two go in the same location. That's interesting. Let's start pumping the Apocalypse, I think. And the Mobius. Yeah. Oh, okay, they don't want to. I don't really want to play here either, to be honest. I think it's the best play, though. If I discard my Apocalypse one more time, it's definitely going to win the right side. Okay. If I go here and here, then they have a lot of work to do. Yeah, I really wish this wasn't random. So I could discard Blade. No, 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 no. There we go. I don't know why I didn't see that. Well, if I do Blade, though, then I guess I have a 50-50. I just got to get lucky with the blade. That doesn't make sense though. I'd rather get lucky. There's more stats, so I guess I just hope that Hella doesn't get discarded. That's pretty much what I'm doing here. And even if it does, my Dracula is going to be huge. All right, now. Oh man. Okay. I should have done her first, so that way she got rid of the blade for sure. So I made that really um, hard on myself. Um, drawing a rock really sucks. Drawing a rock really sucks here. I only have two cards discarded, but as long as one of them goes over here, I should win here and here. Let's see, if he onslaughts here, that'll be 20, 21, 22, 23. But Mobius will get bigger. And if he Spectrums, that's uh, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. That's not Venom. I think this wins. Yeah, I should have put the with the wing first. That really helps. Okay, so what's the next card? I'm still winning on the right. Yep, yep. So I got lucky that game. I missed I messed up my order, but it worked out anyway. So I'll take that. 
Dude, let's see if I can not mess up my order this game. That'd be great. Ooh, I finally have Swarm. Nothing to discard it with, though. This does not look good. I think I actually need to play out the Swarm to lower the amount of cards in my hand, so that way if I draw, like, um... Hell cow and stuff like that, they actually do some work for me. I don't want to fill up this location because I might need to like really contest. And I hope they don't have like a Shang-Chi. Psylocke, okay. This is a Mr. Negative deck, maybe? What the heck? Look at this location. If I discard Hella, I can get it back with Ghost Rider. Okay. This almost definitely wins me this location. Okay. If I Hell Cow discards two things, then I could Hella if Hell is not one of the things and fill up my whole board. And I haven't discarded anything that's actually in my grave. I just popped Apocalypse. Yeah, so there's nothing there. So, yeah, it has to be Hell Cow. In case it's like Black, uh, Black Panther. Okay, it's not Black Panther. So it's going to be Odin to just ramp that location up super high but even if it's Odin and I lose this location I don't super care so I can if it's Odin and I play this then I'm gonna win this location and this location kinda stinks that my Dracula has a not so great of a shot here either Hmm. Do I just Apocalypse here? No, because then it only makes it six anyway, guaranteed. Hmm. Yeah, I want to give this the chance of getting Apocalypse, so... Um, I can bring back other things I can discard, and then it'll guarantee get Apocalypse, right? Oh, Doctor Doom. Okay. Well, that's not that's not terribly impressive, right? Oh yeah, no, no, nothing, nothing. Um, that was gonna come back discarded, but it didn't matter because as soon as he played Doombot, I'm like, I can win in the right, and um, it did get me the middle, so it worked out. I really need to think about what's actually been discarded. I really wish you could like click the icon that said discarded and just say the amount told you like what was discarded. Okay, so this is gonna go away. Just gonna go Sword Master and hope to get Swarm unless I draw a Wing. Okay. Is 
yeah, let's just try and win the left location this way. And I shouldn't have to commit anything else. There we go. Man, they're five power. That's nasty. Don't know how I feel about Dracula. I don't really want to contest the right side at all because of Patriot, so... He could go Patriot and Onslaught, or last turn Patriot Mystique. If I do this, Ghost Rider guaranteed goes away. And if I do this, that means I guaranteed hit a swarm. Let's try it like that. Okay, I feel an Onslaught. Is that enough? This will get four. So I'm adding nine here. Is that enough? If they do onslaught here, um, there'd be seven, eight, and nine added here. So I'd only have to win by eight. Yeah, let's see if this is let's see if this is enough. Yeah, that's really scary. Yeah, we got it. Very nice, very nice. Alright, I think I will end the video there. We had a uh, four game win streak. Um, didn't really combo off super hard with the hell at any point. Um, didn't do anything too crazy. That's kind of what I like about this list is it doesn't need to have those like super high rolly discard games in order to put out a lot of points. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching and I will see you soon.